Hello anyone, Mr. Skyson here and welcome to Be Calm. A short five minute art game similar in nature to Un Memento that I played before. Be Calm is basically a relaxation simulator if we're being honest here. Ambient music set to a very artistically designed world where your only goal is to sit back, relax, and take in the somewhat surreal looking scenery. And I'm cool with that. It's always good to spend a little time doing nothing. So, let's go watch the world go by. So I've actually seen this game for quite a while now. I think it's about a month old. I've seen it a few times. Never really paid it much mind. Very similar to games like Un Momento. It's just, oh, well that's a thing. But then I finally try it out. And it's kind of neat. All very artistic. Everything looks like it's... I like the water. It looks like it's made out of marshmallow fluff. Or some sort of linens. It's very interesting, and... Whatever those are. Little alien flying rays, perhaps. Or maybe just sentient scarves that really like the water. I don't know. It's an art world. You can make it up as you go along. It is what you perceive it as. Very much like the very animated forest nearby. It's very interesting. But yeah, I like games like this. Sometimes you just want to relax. You don't necessarily want to go anywhere, but you want to do something. But you also want to relax. Because it's good to relax. Some people stay too busy. Some people constantly want action-y games. And that's well and good. But I don't know. I like a little bit of downtime from time to time. And time again. I have a nice boat, by the way. It's a little bit wibbly. It ripples. That's very interesting. Even my boat is animated. A little bit of ambient music. It's always very good to relax to. Well, unless you're just one of those that hates ambient music, I suppose. Then relax to whatever music you like. I like a little bit of ambient music to just zone out to at times myself. Although, personally, I frequent white noise. Is everything going out of focus? It is. Hey, my little sentient scarf friends are now heat signatures. Fascinating. I like the visuals on those. They look cool. Yeah, everything's got a sort of posterized look. It's very strange. But I like it. Yeah, it's all clouds. Very fast moving clouds. Is there weather coming? Yeah, this is a five-minute game, uh, game in quotations, a five-minute experience, let's put it that way, where you can get different weather, different scenery, you're just going around on a boat, having a nice relaxing time, and it's not limited to just this, so it's not just loaded up, you see this, you're done. From what I've seen, you actually do get more than one scene to play out. And that's kind of neat on the developer's part. They give you more than just this. So it's not just a limited experience. I like it when developers are creative like that. They don't just limit their game or their experience to just one thing. It's like, hey, they might like this. But they might get bored of it. Let's do more. Ooh, Emerald Sky. Everything's on fire. Help. Yeah, this is neat. I thought this might be a good thing to play for the new year. You know, go out on a relaxing note. After all the... Holiday hullabaloo and all that. You get done with your parties. You get done with your gatherings. 
You just want to relax for a little bit. So this seems like a perfect game for that. All the ambient noise. You get the waves. A few little birds here and there. It's a good thing. I like it. And I hope you enjoy it too. Because no matter what you're doing, no matter who you are, it's always good to relax. Hmm. How am I steering this, by the way? Uh-oh. Goodbye. Now, as I was saying, welcome to the snowy north. We have ice. A little bit more ice. It's pretty nice. I like this place. Always like a nice cold setting at the end of a day. Because I don't know. Something peaceful about the the snowy regions, icebergs, even just the floating bits of ice. I'm my own frozen beverage. Ooh. Oh, that's kind of neat. Yeah, I can do a 360. But I never noticed that before. The way the water is churning directly behind me. It's like a big fluffy pillow. Or a butt. Yeah. This is a neat thing. I can definitely recommend it. If you like relaxing. Or... Strange artistic games of this nature. Because it's something neat to look at. I think it has a picture mode. So you can make your own wallpapers. Or just send neat pictures to people. Oh, we have wind. Whoa. That really adds a lot to this, having the, the wind swirling around. See, so you have plenty of visuals with the water, the clouds, and all that. But I feel like this place would look a lot different without the wind swirling. And it looks like we have more of our little flying friends again. Although they're a bit different this time. What are they, kites now? We went from scarves to kites. We're being followed through this weird, weird world by sentient objects. Well, at least we aren't going through this journey alone. So that's kind of neat. So yeah, I'm digging this. Oh, I just noticed my boat's a different color. Neat. Is it a color changing boat? Is in a mood boat. Am I in a better mood now, so we got a different boat? Or is it maybe the lighting? I don't know. Maybe I have a boat for every day of the week. And I like that you get different lighting. I think everything's getting a bit brighter now. Water is a touch more blue, I think. Seems like it anyway. Everything's becoming a bit more clear. So long as I don't stare into the sun. Nice with the light beams, though. Always like nice lighting in games. I don't think this game actually has much in lighting, but it does have the light going around some of the objects over there, and that's also a nice bonus with me. Ooh, darker water. It's so pretty. Oh, purple water. Neat. Oh, evening sky. Pink clouds, oranges, all that stuff coming. It's a good time. I've said that before, but it's true. It's the end of the day. Perfect time for the end of the year. Some people are already celebrating. Some people are not. For those who have and those who have not, Happy New Year. I like that my video release day lined up with New Year's. Usually I have to do something special just for the holiday. I don't have to, I choose to. But still. Ooh, we get an Aurora. Now that's nice. That's cool. Definitely works well with the whole surrealism thing going on. With everything being so 
bizarre. In a good way. Do I have falling fog? Or is that supposed to be snow? I don't know. Again, it's all subjective, so it is whatever you want it to be, I suppose. Oh, goodbye. But anywho, this has been Be Calm. I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you did, think of the like button a tap. And if you want to see more like this or more from me, think of the subscribe button a big thumbs up. I will see you all next time, and remember to stay groovy.